Hey guys, it's Evie. It's been a while. I just wanted to share a, another, another haul. Um, this one is actually from Tuesday morning. Um, I'm really excited because um, I went to a Tuesday morning that was a little further away from me. The one uh, closest to me never has any of the goodies that I've been seeing on Instagram or on uh, YouTube. So I was really excited. I took um, an extra 15 minutes to go further out and it was so much worth it. Um, anyway, really quickly, I got some thickers, real pretty. They were like um, the um, craft color with the white, but I could use that for like a beach theme. Um, this paper, I was really excited to see it. It's like a shimmery silver paper. So um, it was only $1.99 and uh, you get 10 sheets and I'm looking forward to cutting out some uh, words from that. I got a planner for work, um, a simple planner. I'm not going to going to be embellishing this one. It has, it's really neat inside um, and uh, has, you know, the uh, weekly view and daily view with little check boxes. So perfect for work. I was super excited to find these two uh, dies. This one's a steel roll die by Spellbinders and it makes a three by three by three box. Really excited about that and super excited to find this uh, steel roll die by RG, Richard Gadai. Um, it makes that box right there and I was super excited to see that. It's a nice, it's a huge die. Um, and really excited that I got, um, I was able to find this. I know um, I could have found it online um, with the thin metal die, but the, I can really um, cut this a lot quicker using my, I have an AccuCut machine, so really looking forward to using that. Um, I found this set of brush, water brush pens, which I thought was really cool. They are a pack of six for $9.99, and you can see it goes from thin all the way to thick. So, never seen that before. This was on clearance, $1.99, basil paper, six by six. Okay, always um, can use that. And excited to find this. This is a, um, a tag punch board. Um, never seen this before at Tuesday morning or even in Hobby Lobby or any of the local craft shops. So excited to find this. Um, and this was really cool. I'm hoping this is a magnetic um, magnetic uh, self-healing mat. Um, it's um, referred to as a cutting mat. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm thinking of trying to use this in my Gemini, um, Gemini Junior. So we'll see if that works. Um, <coughs> oh, excuse me. And super excited to find this. This is the um, this is by We Are Memory Keepers, and it's the, it's called the Precision Press. I have the um, stamp. What is it called? The stamp. Um, uh, whatever. It's by Tim Holtz. It resembles um, the Misty, but um, this one is a little different because it allows you to, with using the pegs, you can um, lift it up and move it down and make multiple designs if you'd like. Um, so looking forward to using that. Found a lot of dies. This is what this one is made by Tonic, and this is a um, uh, castle resembles the Disney castle. Super excited to find this one. Um, this one has a lot of detail in it and it's a five by seven die. So really excited to find that. And that's by um, Cra uh, Crafter's Companion. This one's by Tonic. Excited about this one too. Look how beautiful that is. It's a nice big die. And this one was different. I've never seen this one before and um, it's called Perfect Partners Metal Die Set. It's an anemone, if that's how you pronounce it. And look at the beautiful dies. And if you can, if I can do the embossing on it, it should come out beautiful. And then use my water brushes with watercolors. Excited about this one, $4.99. And this came with nine dies. It's, um, it makes all of those edges really cool. And don't mean to get you guys dizzy. Here's a bird die and some edibles that I was able to find. Great prices. 
This one was cool. It's a, um, a rose. Uh, not a rose. It's a um, bouquet of roses. And there's this one. And this one was a fun one. I thought I could use this to create um, gingerbread houses for the holidays. And I found some really pretty Christmas stickers. $1.99. Can't beat that. Envelopes. I'm always running out of envelopes because I tend to make cards out of my cardstock rather than buying the card packs. So um, this is a pack of A2, 50 A2 envelopes for $2.99. And then these are five by fives, or five and a half by five and a half, excuse me. Um, and each pack is t holds 25, so I got two of them at $1.99 each. And I love the beach, and I got this paper. It has um, 12 sheets in it for $2.99, and it's hard to tell because it is in the packaging, but it has a glossy finish. Oh, maybe you can see it there on the seahorses and the crab so everything is kind of like embossed and has that gloss over it really cool and some lavender cardstock and then I also got some items on clearance for my mink so these are just like the old older inventory of items but they were 40% uh, off is the yellow sticker now so pretty cool so I was super excited to get all of these goodies and um, thanks for watching and hope you guys are enjoying a fun crafting weekend. Take care. Bye-bye.